What are some of the most annoying SIGs in Brawlhalla? By yours truly. Now, starting off, I have Cassidy's side single hammer. This SIG is an insane signature. The fact that out of end light on six defense legends, she can get a free side SIG is a true combo. And on five defense and less, it's one frame and it's harder to do. But it's it, it's true. That's all that's all that matters. And the crazy part about this signature is that you can use it as a punisher. So singing with Cassidy is optimal. This is a, a Cassidy optimal play now. But that's not the crazy part. It's crazy because you got to guess between that side sig and if Cassidy is going to do her broken lasso in sig. Yeah! We all seen this coming. It's Orion and it's Orion's down sig. This sig is a stupid sig. It got nerfed, but it's still annoying to fight especially if you're getting hit over and over by this like the fact that this sig covers spears weaknesses that it hit, doesn't hit stacked and this forces a spear player to move around well guess what orion players can just rip this sig out and call it a day <laughs> i hate this character so much fighting this character is awful queen nine queen nine i love your character love your skins but i hate fighting you you are mad annoying and i hate this d sig right here it flows in Katara's kit so well. It, it's it's so bad. Like the fact that Queen I can just rip it just raw down air D Sig. It's annoying to deal with. It, you just dash and you just get clipped by it or spot dodge. You get clipped by it and side light D Sig. It's also very annoying. It does the same thing as down air D Sig. This character is dumb. Wu Shang and it's not just Wu Shang. It's this Ang crossover that all these Wu Shang players be just buying and it's you abusing with his broken rock side sig stomp and who saying stupid in sig on spear those two together is so annoying because i gotta guess between both of them and whooshing players every time i'm in orange or red i get hit by side light and they're trying to do in sig on me just stop bro i'm sick of the sig the sig it covers dodge down covers spot dodge dodges away it, it's so bad and the fact that oh yeah just dodge up and like avoid it guess what spear just hits you with recovery and just like bro i hate this sig so much yumi yumiko i love you one of my favorite characters but um i can see why people think you're annoying this d sig actually both probably these sigs but i'm gonna say hammer more so it, it covers hammer's weakness that it has no grounded anti-air option so you could just basically rip a D sig and boom, you're basically just safe and just chilling. But when this sig starts getting annoying, is when she does this over and over again, setting it up, setting up over and over, get you with these hammer setups and just do it again and again and again. Just please stop. From Orion to Artemis, and since both of these characters have a rivalry in lore, anything you can do, I can do better looking all Artemis want to have more annoying signatures on both of her weapons, especially this side tick. This side tick, sometimes you can punish it, sometimes you cannot punish it, and you know it's coming out, but you still get hit by it. The sig is stupid, and I might as well just add in the side signatures because this has no recovery times. This is kind of this kind of broken, bro. Uh-huh, uh-huh, y'all Sigil players die, y'all can hide. Man, if y'all get y'all C of these fire the cannons all trying to spam me with NC. But luckily, y'all other six kind of trash. So I may let this slide. Nah, I won't let this slide. Because y'all all play the same. Even when y'all try to go off stage, y'all try to GC it too. I'm not falling for this. Zariel, Zariel. Honestly, matter of fact, it's not Zario. It's this loser Devil, Devil Jin. Man, I already do not like you in Tekken, but bro they just all use this crossover with zario and they spam these six and they're just it's just so like he does not need two spike matter of fact three spike signatures on bow like bow already has spiking tools just give him more hello what even worse than 2v2s oh yeah you thought i forgot you also a crossover abuser yeah that one right there mm-hmm another character that's underrated that can get away with broken sigs oh 
what i'm gonna do oh i do the side take oh no recovery times you can't punish oh i can come off it let's go oh what am, what am i gonna do oh i'm a side take oh psych i'm doing this one. Ooh, i'm going this one Ooh, ooh. what i'm gonna do oh i'm gonna do this one ah uh -huh. oh i did this one you guessed wrong well so you try to punish oh give up oh i did a side take oh Oh, did a side six. Ooh, ooh. I'm not gonna lie. These new characters just be having sauced up six of old character six. And this six is so annoying. It's Kaya D six on steroids and can kill. Like, bro, stop throwing out the six. Oh, oh, okay. I won't throw out the six. Because N six, this giant hitbox six. I'm so glad it does like 20 damage. It does not have a lot of force. Because, man, this character will be broken. And Blaster is not the best right now. So I'm glad because once Blasters get buffed, this character is literally going to be S tier. Last but not least, Imugi. He's more like an honorable mention, to be honest. But still, he, he is broken, man. This down sig is so dumb. Go backwards, go forwards, and he just s s speedily flies down when he charges D sig off the edge. It's really dumb. And his side sig on Great Sword is broken too. But since he's a new character, he's guaranteed to get nerfed. And that is pretty much it i know there's a lot of characters i didn't mention like loki and his side sig or thea and her six but loki side sig drops this is not good he dies basically super fast and lord vrax uh, he's not as bad even though he's kind of getting like broken broken now once blasters buff is over 